Hello and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. Now, first things first, I want to do a short rest. The second thing is, I want to see... Okay, never mind. I want to see if um, Halsin will follow us through the priestesses. Okay, great. Uh, if he will follow us through the... Oh, wait. They're not here. here I probably killed them. Of course. Wait, scroll or verify, that will be... You were seen stealing. Resolving this peacefully will require more caution than you displayed in getting caught. What was taken is free to be reclaimed, and you are free to go. I didn't expect him to see me here. Okay, never mind. Uh, let's get in here. Moving objects. We can move objects around stronger characters. Ah, I see. That was the answer <laughs> to the riddle. Yeah. Smoke powder. Wait, wait, wait. Close the door first. You, I want to lockpick the chest. We can add bonus. Okay, dance. Okay, so this is how I can add those. <laughs> you kidding? Do Steve's tools again. Okay, we get guidance. Is that the exact same result? Hmm. Now it worked. We go in here and let's see if he falls. Because if he will follow us down, then that means we'll be able to use. Where are you going? Uh, what you want to do? Enemies to kill. The other leaders are dead, but Mintara has left for the grove. Hurry then, I will meet you there. May Sylvanus guide us. Great. So that means we can go down the defiled temple. All the way over there. So yeah, what I was talking about was this one. This should be fully black, this should be fully white, and they should be half black, half white. But I forced it, so uh. there's no problem. And I just want to use the waypoint that we unlocked. Goblins are such violent parasites. Not the vilest any of us have seen of late, unfortunately. Push my feet. And let's go. We're going. <sighs> I'm not sure if this is the one. No. Oh, now I can see. Wait. Okay, never mind. Here, I think.
Now, the thing is... I'm not quite sure if there is any other way for us to... Not really. Wait, wait, wait. Was there any other way inside the camp? I, we didn't go out here. But I... No, I don't see any other way. Okay, so... Let's save. And let's get up here. Of course, we're gonna go the stupidest way possible. And the game will be will start lagging all of a sudden. Never end. Wait, 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 wait. don't understand this. Okay, the next day we have one more camp that we can make for the attack. That's right. Can we tell Zarian that... Zarian? What's it? Zevlor. <laughs> can we tell Zevlor that our Goblin should... Is on the way? By the way, this place here. Ah! No. Wait, home? Yes. Like I said, camera here sometimes is, is your worst enemy. And I mean it. Devlar, hello. Our time grows short. If Korga won't abandon her madness, then we'll have to try the road. Goblins or no. Mm, I want to discuss something what is it? else. Halsin mm, Halsin's Al alive. He's being held captive by Out goblins. Above. This is wonderful news, but I've seen what goblins do to their captives. Uh, he broke free. To his rescue. But my people would just wind up slaughtered along with him. I'll... I'll pray for him. So long as the goblins hold the roads, I'm afraid it's all we can do. No word from the scouts. Oh. oh but if there's a clear path past those goblins, they'll find it. Yes. There's a ladder up here. Of course. This ladder. Hi. Used to think the goblins would kill us the second we set foot outside. But after hearing what you did at the gate, well, I still think they'll kill us. But at least we can put up a fight. Hmm. Will you? I don't see many soldiers. We're tougher than we look. We've survived persecution, survived Avernus. Who knows? Some of us might even make it to Baldur's Gate. If you survive the hells, you'll survive this. <laughs> There's optimism, and then there's stupid, hun. Plenty of us fell to monsters already. I don't see the rest of us lasting long out there. But if you're so sure we will, why not put a little gold on the line? Hmm. Sure. It's a bet. Excellent. And since I ain't one to leave a debt unpaid, that means we're destined to meet in Border's Gate. Looking forward to it. Okay, what's your name? Lacrisa. Lacrisa, Lacrisa, Lacrisa. Remember to look for Lacrisa in Baldur's Gate. Okay. Um, 
Maybe we can talk to the druids. And I still want to see what's happening mm, in this map. Uh, I can teleport just like that. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like it one bit. You guys not coming, really? I still want to see what's happening over here, this side. And now we can go down this elevator. Hello, Timber. I hope Truffle is not there anymore. Yeah, she went away. This no. Raphael flaunts his paltry wings as if he wants to impress us. You saw the red dragon slaying his infernal kin above hell's fires, did you not? Next to a dragon, the devil's a gnat. When I am Kithrak, I will take my queen Vlakith his head as a trophy. Okay, cool. Kithrak, what does that mean? Githyanki knights, the riders that chase the Nautiloid. They are the commissars and enforcers of my queen Vlakith's will. Vlakith bestows no greater honor. To wield a Kithrak silver sword is my destiny. I will earn my queen's favor, and I will conquer every layer of hell should she command it. Why were these knights chasing the Mind Flayer ship? The Geich are my kind's mortal enemy. It is not unusual for the Kithrak to give chase, to penetrate the hells. This is unusual. But I'm not one to question the wisdom of my queen. I can see but to the horizon. Blackest sight pierces the many planes. Okay, can I now use the lever? Thank you. Okay, now... Um, let's talk to... Where is she? It was you? It was you, okay. Again? Okay, I want to tell you he's alive, but if you're such a... I'm just trying to see if someone cares that he's, their leader is alive. Until Master Halston returns, my eyes must stay on Korga. Okay, so no one cares for the news that he is coming back. They'll care only when he is already back. Okay, and where is this place that I'm curious about? This way? This way. Over here, I believe. I'm really interested it's over here. Right, we did not manage to talk to that Warlock. of mine will turn to ash words of mine will turn to ash when you call the last light down moon reminds me of your grace moon reminds me of your grace all the love i can't repay rest and know that i will pray Farewell, my dear old friend. Wait, that's it! Turn 
Look how proud she looks. Thank you. I was having trouble finding the words. What's the song about? Lihala. My teacher. And friend. Sorry. Damn it. It's alright. Let it all out. I don't usually. I'm all right. I haven't finished a song since Lihala died. I haven't played at all, if I'm honest. She was playing her lute. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. There was so much blood. Uh, I can still smell it. I'm sure teacher will be proud to see you now. She'd yell at me for that meter and make me play it over and over again. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Finish the Weeping Dawn for her. I have a long way to go. But thank you. Uh, I needed this. Well, you've come up with a fine tribute for her. Thanks. Lehala made me love music. The sound, the feel, the thrill. But when she died, it was gone. Until now, I'd forgotten what it was like. That itch in my fingers to perfect a song. The Weeping Dawn will be my gift to her. Thank you. I... I needed this. You're welcome. The book is a clear work in progress, though already extensive, chronicling various musical styles and notation from across Faerun. Amid the orderly symbols and blackened ink, one page stands out. It is a wash in color and meandering arcs. The script below reads Nakoni's song By Okma I hear it and I see and I know it and I feel it, but I can write it. Or can I? Please, make it stop! Uh, so, down. what's wrong? Can't you hear it? Her singing. It's awful. Terrible. Um, don't mock her. She's trying her best, I assume. Oh no, whatever shall we do? More witless creatures. More ear bleed. My head is melting. I'm leaving before the damage is permanent. Then why were you staying here all this time? Those damn squir squirrels. 
Is something happening? If we can go up here. Investigate the beach? Why? Oh, I see someone's down there. It's beautiful. It's not like I can do anything right now. I'm trying to have a conversation with him, but... Staying out in the water is dangerous. Don't you hear it? It's so peaceful. Focus on trying to hear what he A hears. Sweet melody plays above the waves, beckoning you, drowning out all logical thought. Focus by singing. suddenly fades as the spell breaks. You are free. Keep singing, I guess. Advantage. Reason. Bard. Indeed. to hit, they rolled 19. Okay, we roll it. He resisted. Not enough movement. Oh, but we can use sleep on her. No! Damn you. Kid, can you at least use your oh, you don't have potions? Uh, and have to keep going. Yeah, what do you mean? What? Concentration broken. Great. Dead. A better position. 
It's on wisdom saving throw, so <laughs> I'm not surprised that they both fail at it. Okay, you know what? Hit her, but oh, an ally you touch. Okay, never mind. Really? Okay, do you have anything to do on your? You can heal yourself. Please do. What is this? My head. I will have your head. Okay, they resisted this time, so I would much rather start hitting her. it would end like this. Head, okay. That didn't work. Kill her first. You help her. Kill yourself, maybe first. Kill you. It was your action. Oh, sorry. Will it help if I tell you that I didn't expect that will happen? Deep as well. You are safe now. Th that's what the voice said. I almost got to the nest, but the singing. I need to get back. Mo will be so mad. <laughs> Wait, um, you should meet Mo. She'll be grateful you helped me. Find a boy called Donny. Tell him you want to see the dragon's lair. Ah, Donny. Mm. 
Nothing. Oh, gold. Bone. I don't care about bone. He wanted to press ahead. Get to the nest. Which is not here, but wait, where's the nest? I was sure it was over here. Maybe it's over here. Oh, it's over there. Okay. By the way, what's here? Because I think... Polish dagger, oh. Is it somehow special or just a... Uh, let's see, where is it? Dagger, dagger, Polish dagger, three to six. Okay, never mind. Um, yeah, there you cannot go, but I want you to get... Oh, you can get over here, great. I kinda know what to do. We'll see about the execution. Oh, Justy. Get over here. It's a very long day. For sure. Oh, for the road. Okay, now get over here. Come on, and jump over there. Now I'm gonna save just in case it wasn't all of the harpies. Now, target is too far. Uh, you. Action, not reaction. Ring of color spray, I got supply pack, okay. Back here. Any time to rest? Uh, no, 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 but back to her. Okay, great, and we can go back. I think that is all here. I mean, there's another little island over here, but I don't think there's anything else of interest. Objective noted. If you don't mind, I'll switch back to me. Um, there's also this place. We can jump on the p pillars. And I want to do it. Do it. Why would I want to? Oh. Light crossbow. Okay. This is a very useful mechanic. So just jumping it gives you so many possibilities. Donnie, we need to look for Donnie. Are you Donnie? Arabella? Matisse Donny mm. Oh, 
that's you. <sighs> Donny, isn't it? I want to see the dragon slayer. Nods, then reaches for a concealed hatch. Hey, thanks for showing me the door. <laughs> it's not like we saw it before, really. But we did. Get over here. Oh, it doesn't work anymore. Ten turns. Wait, don't you have Misty Step? So I guess you stay there. What now? I should mind my step. Because I'm out of short rest. Make sure we'll stay there. As long as we don't sort out things over here. I'm all. Well, look who's come to visit. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. I heard you helped Melly with that locket. I owe you for that. Mercon says you got him out of a tight spot with some harpies. Gotta say, I'm impressed. You saved Arabella from the druids. Don't know what those bastards would have done. And thanks for going easy on Sylphie. Not many marks would have done the same. Why are you running all these schemes and swindles? It's risky, you know. We're saving up for a better hideout when we get to Baldur's Gate. Why? You planning on telling me stealing is wrong? Quite the opposite. I want to invest in the new Steve's Guild on the sword cost. Won't turn down free money. I've got operating costs you wouldn't believe. Come see me in the city sometime, huh? I'll repay this and then some. See you around, maybe. Great, we just got ourselves a guild of my I need new pockets to pick. And yeah, this is the way the, the small hole. Hands on everything. We have to lay low for a while. I knew he wasn't yeah. ready. Can you stop? It's not like you never got caught. Hmm. I wonder where this leads. Too high. Yep, too high. Don't any of you got any jumping Can't left? What a day. Passing lights. Why not? Mind. It's a con well, concentration yeah. spell, which means he won't be able to use any other concentration spell while he has those dancing lights active. And he lost the concentration already? Careful, I bind. Oh no, it works for Let's 10 go. minutes. Oh, never mind. Ten rounds, sorry, which means it's work, it works for six minutes. If we could at least make a run for it. Okay, she stayed there, so yes, I need her to be part of the team. So I need to make. You liar. Could have come back here all that all this time. Okay. Hmm. Seems Maybe we can buy something for hi from him. There's just so many things we can. Need anything else? Oh, yes. What are you selling? Bits and bobs I no longer need. 
Oh, that's some very nice bits and bobs. That's heavy armor. Heavy armor as well. Ooh. Uh, what do you have? Kifianki half plate. This is... Oh, this is what you are wearing. is medium armor. So what you have right now is better. You have light armor. Medium, medium. Medium. Whoops. Light armor. This one will be better for you. Plus one to stealth checks. That would be better both for you. What is that? Wait, what is that? Oh, it's quarter stuff. Temporal damage. Oh, gloves of missile snaring. Sure. I'll give you for that two javelins, some boots, some skulls, some candles. Uh, well, I'll keep grease bottles. Oh. No, I... Really? They had to do it like this? Uh, I think I'm carrying the most stuff. Amethyst ring, gold ring, silver ring. The jewelry I have. Can you just click it? Oh. Okay, double click. Works. Cup, plate, incense, bronze goblet. Nope, give me back my book. Server ingots, both onyxes, malachite, agate. Is that all? That could be all. will be pleased with, with this oh, of course you will be pleased wait I don't want those shoes can you give me them give them back Sylvanas guide your path yeah, yeah, yeah now this one is for you this is also for you this is medium armor. This will be better for you. I'll give you a circle back. And those... I will equip them by myself. To myself. Although you don't have any gloves, so you take those. Okay. And will we share our gold? No. So give me a little gold. Bring back my bloody armor. It will be easier. Hmm. You have gold ring. Okay. So let's get up here and to be as close to the gate as possible. Are guys coming? I'll save and let's end the day. The air is heavy. Moisture drips down your forehead. Pain shoots through your fingers.
Your hands shake as they reach upward. Your forehead remains drenched, no matter how much you wipe. Can you feel it crawling through you? Tendrils squirming in your chest, gripping your heart, piercing your belly. Your bones popping, your flesh swelling. I can. I see it in you. I feel it in me. We are lost. I will be quick with my blade. First you, then the others. Then, myself. Your minds intertwine. You sense a touch of uncertainty. A touch of disgust. Explore her mind. mind lurches, reeling suddenly as if bitten. Lazelle's fear grips you. Not fear of death, but fear of insignificance. The great warrior Lazelle, a failure to her kind. She will wield no silver sword, ride no red dragon. Forever unknown to the great Lich Queen Vlacketh. Be strong, he'll survive this. You will please your queen. I will not let the Geich take me. I will earn Vlacketh's honor. I will wait. But know this. I am watching. If the sickness does not pass come dawn, I will end us all. Just in time, you are transforming. I know your voice, I've heard it before. Yes, you have. I saved you before. And I'm here to save you again. Don't worry. You will not become a Mind Flayer. Not while I'm around. I'll protect you. We haven't much time, so listen closely. There is great potential within you. It comes from that parasite. Your instinct is to resist the power it gives, but you must accept it. Nurture it. I will keep it from consuming you. But for the sake of both of us, you must learn to wield it. your potential. I have to go. The enemy is closing in. I will be back. Wake now. 
You'll feel better. I promise. Give me a moment. Mm. Now, how do I keep him well, friend? Hmm. I'm sorry about what happened to your master. Master, friend. I stayed with him until until I knew he was gone. I'll never forget him. But I'm glad to have met you. Hello, Volo. Ah, my good fellow. Quite the cozy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you so much. I was just settling in and reviewing my latest findings. Mind flares, cultists, and, of course, your esteemed company. <laughs> Why, I'm practically an expert. They've tentacles, you know. Quite sure. The druid Halson had some kind of mind flare specimen in a jar in his quarters. A replica, no doubt, but truly fascinating to see up close. As a matter of fact, I do. But why do you? Not only have I encountered a mind flare, I've killed one. That... That can't be. Did we kill Mind Flayer? I'm also been infected by one of their parasites. That's quite impossible. You'd have undergone ceramorphosis by now. Hmm. If only your disbelief could alter facts. If what you say were true, you'd be a Mind Flayer by now. You? Infected by a Mind Flayer? <laughs> Ridiculous! Isn't it? Examine me. Found out, find out for yourself. Perhaps that's for the best. I'd be irresponsible not to debunk such a strange claim. If I just here in your eye, I could quickly... Oh, dear sweet gods! Quit the shouting. Can you help? I mean, yes. I suppose I can. I'll need to research the particulars, however. Give me a bit of time, and I'll have this little issue sorted. No. Oh. Okay. So give, he gave us laser of benevolence. Though I don't... <laughs> just as we don't need it. Um, this is light armor. No, we don't need it. But you don't look unwell. You don't... you look unwell. My apologies. Huh. Not quite myself just yet. I had the strangest dream last night. A visitor came to me. A vision of unparalleled beauty and power. She told me she was watching over me, protecting me, and that our tadpoles could prove beneficial if we embrace what powers they have to offer. An uncanny apparition. I'm not entirely sure what to make of it. I had the same dream, a similar visitor with a similar message. Very curious. In all my readings on the effects of illithid parasites, I've never come across any accounts of 
correlating dreams between infected parties. Another unique quality of our predicament, perhaps. Hmm. Are you inclined to take these visitors at their word? I'm not sure. Such an apparition has its own motives, whatever it told us. Nothing wrong with maintaining a healthy suspicion in such matters. Still, it might be wiser to keep an open mind on the matter. Our visitors' promises of aid might yet bear valuable fruit. Okay, so you will be willing to eat a tadpole? Are you right? You look a bit unwell. I broke him. <laughs> Nothing about a bit of magic and so. You see, I have this condition. Very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. Can it be cured? No. It cannot be cured. And I assure you I've left no page unturned in reaching that conclusion. I can keep this condition under control, as indeed I've done for a significant amount of time, but that was under different circumstances altogether. Home in Waterdeep. What it comes down to is this. Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. What kind of items are we talking about exactly? Oh, staffs, tomes, cowls. The form doesn't matter, so long as it's brimming with weave. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact, since before we were abducted. It is time, and by that I mean it's imperative that I find and consume strands of weave at the earliest possible juncture. Mm, where do you suggest we find the artifacts we need? We've already done the finding. In fact, you have one in your possession. You know for yourself how hard won such an item was, and it will be no easier when even more are required to assuage my hunger. There'll be danger involved, or great cost. What? Mm -mm -mm -mm. I expected as much. Don't worry, I'll help you. Splendid! Bit of boldness will serve us well. As luck would have it, you're already primed to give me exactly what I need. Okay, give him something. Aren't those two things I need? This one? Does it have to be something someone is wearing? Really? Okay. I guess this. We don't really need dancing light. That's oh, it. Thank you. Oh, that hit the spot. I can feel it work. The magic, it's like a lullaby that sings to sleep the demon inside. A metaphorical demon, I haste to point out, but no less dangerous. And no less bound to wake up again to continue its ravages. Such is the nature of all monsters. Hmm. I'm glad you're feeling better. Your condition sounds unpleasant, to say the least. Oh, it's not so bad once you get used to it. And, on the plus side, my tower in Waterdeep has never been so free of clutter. Hmm. Sincerely, though, I understand I ask a lot from you with few answers in return. But in time, all will be told. Hmm. That condition of yours is a very expensive one. I obtained it in Waterdeep. Nothing there comes cheap. Okay, but seriously, I have this on me and I couldn't donate it. I would gladly do. Or this? Instead, we are left with... Okay, he just consumed the locket. Okay. 
Okay, let's see. Ring of Color Spray. This is... You're gonna take it. I already told that you're gonna take it. Okay, give her the dagger. Give her the weapons that we're gonna sell. And the femur. Give me the agate. Uh, so I'll stick... I'll keep those magical items. Um... That you give me the soul coin. Anything else? I think that's all. Okay, anyone else wants to talk? You? Did you have the same dream? Gale is positively voracious. Well, let him suck up all the magic he needs, as long as he doesn't snack on a Githyanki silver sword. Okay. You know, I've been thinking, and I think there's something I should tell you. Nothing big or terrible, just a small little detail about me that <laughs> hasn't come up naturally. <laughs> it's just that I happen to be a... Uh, what's the best way to put this? A vampire. Well, yes, obviously. Right. Well, <laughs> glad we got that out of the way. So, was there anything else? Um, what do you think is waiting for us at the Moonrise Towers? Who knows? Drow? Mind flayers? Death? Hopefully not ours. But maybe answers. If we can convince the right people to talk. Was there a way that him being a vampire would come up, up naturally at any point? So there was... Gale just consumes magical items like I do wine. We truly are a group apart. Nevertheless, as quirks go, that's a new one for me. Why were you in pain before? The wound on my hand. It never quite heals. And sometimes it causes terrible pain to rip through me. It's my burden, though, from Lady Shah. I can feel her influence somehow. Why would Shah subject you to such a thing? I cannot say. Not with what I can recall. But even then... It would not be for me to question her will. Lady Shah has her reasons. What causes it to hurt you? It's difficult to say. Sometimes I wonder if it's supposed to be guiding me, punishing me, testing me. But perhaps it's none of those. Perhaps it's completely random. I'd like to hope there's more to it than that. Some meaning that Lady Shah will reveal to me when the time is right. Until then, all I can do is endure. Hmm. How can you manage, manage living such a thing with such a thing? It's less difficult than you might imagine when you can't remember life without it. Pain is sacred to followers of Lady Shah. Pain will give way to loss and then to the peace of her eternal darkness. You can tolerate a great deal of suffering so long as it has meaning. So you knew more than you were letting on before. I hope you'll be more honest in future. I'll try my best. But secrecy is ingrained in me. Lady Shah considers it greater protection than any shield or armor. Uh, okay, since we have a lot more to talk about, I'm gonna end this part here. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon.